play to go forward. Winks has won from the outside with a barrier draw. And ring-a-ding-ding, -ding, the three-year-old on her outside. So Winks goes forward. And ring-a-ding-ding -ding now is the last to move in for the agency, George Ryder Stakes. The last time we'll see Winks race here on a home track at Rose Hill. Red light. Racing down the George Ryder and Dreamforce and prompt response got the best of the starter. Sosie Bonaway well, followed by Brutal Telly Play Land of Plenty. Winks is staying out pretty wide and Ring a Ding Ding is the last one. Dreamforce presses on after the first couple of hundred metres. It's looking to get to a clear lead of the 1200 metres, but it's cast a little bit deep around Sosie Bon and Brutal's booting through. So Dreamforce leads by three quarters to Brutal. Sosie Bon in a forward roll third, then prompt response from Telly Play. Land of Plenty winks up on the outside and Ring-a-Ding-Ding's last of all. Dreamforce got to the front now clearly. Brutal came off the fence to sit outside it. Then came Sosi Bond. Prompt response getting closer. Further back to Telly Play. Winks is covering a bit of ground, avoiding the kickback. Then Land of Plenty and Ring-a-Ding-Ding -ding is the last one. Five lengths from first to last. Dreamforce the leader from Brutal. Sosi Bond and Winks is starting to take closer order in a four-wide position. Then prompt response from Telly play ring a ding ding getting onto the back of wings and land of plenty's been shuffled back to last they come around the turn and the george rider it's dream force brutal wings is staying out in the middle of the track and bowman hasn't moved a muscle clear from prop response and sosi bon now he shakes the rein of wings and takes the lead from brutal and dream force and now she starts to go into overdrive she's won four cox plates for chipping Nortons, and now for George Riders, he's the world champion Winks, simply invincible, wins it by three lengths to Brutal, Dreamforce third, Prompt Response fourth, and so Bond land of plenty, ring-a-ding-ding -ding and telly play. What a list of achievements. To win four Cox Plates, then four Chipping Nortons, and an effortless performance, as expected, here in the George Ryder at an all-time bottom-out betting price of a dollar and five cents today. She makes it 32 in a row, 24 Group 1s, and now she's three weeks away from saying goodbye to racing on the track when she lines up in the Queen Elizabeth Stakes on day two of the championships. The, the three-year-old Brutals run a terrific race in second. Dreamforce holding third and prompt response fourth. And there was a big margin covering the field as they went past the post. They've run 132.20 and a big win again to Winx, her fourth here in the George Ryder. 4925 official with Paul Joyce uh, joining us again and easy as ever.